Hello and welcome to today's action figure review. Today's collectible is based on an Australian muscle car from the 80s. The Holden VL Commodore Walkinshaw. Here's a quick look at the box. Just a quick history lesson on the car that this model is based on. Built in 1988, the last facelift on the first generation Commodore, the VL and the first car built by HSV, which is an acronym for Holden Special Vehicles, Oh, and look, it comes with its own certificate of authenticity. <clears throat> Peter Brock's HDT came to an end after an argument with Holden. Holden started up their own performance vehicle division, HSV. They contracted the British TWR, acronym for Tom Walkinshaw Racing, to help them build a performance car. And here's a look at the little bad boy out of its box. The VL Commodore Walkinshaw was only available in Panorama Silver. And apart from its outrageous body kit, it became the first Holden V8 to be fuel injected. It also came with four bolt mains and twin throttle body inlet manifold. The body kit was designed to minimize drag and to maximize downforce. It boasts a 180 kilowatt 5 litre V8 engine and only 750 of them were ever made. This stunning piece was manufactured by Classic Car Lectibles. It is 1 18th scale and it's made out of the finest materials, including die cast metal. It has a highly detailed interior, including a working steering wheel that turn the wheels. Here's a look at the bottom. They only made 5,000 units of these. And as you can see here, this is number 2,752. The attention to detail is evident in every aspect from the silver paint finish to the intricate interior and engine components. Let's pop open this bonnet and have a little look at its engine. It even comes with a little bonnet support rod. Well, that concludes today's figure review. I hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for the next one. Ta-ta.